Hi guys, back again with another video. Now in this video, we are going to do the real life comparison and test of the JBL Lavalier mic uh, with the Boya mic. So uh, these two are the current uh, budget favorite of everyone. Uh, JBL is quite new. Uh, Boya has been there for a long time. I've been using uh, personally. I've been using Boya for the past three years. So in this video, you will be hearing three different sounds. One from the phone, which is an iPhone uh, without a mic. Uh, then you have the JBL one over here, which is connected to a uh, Samsung uh, S7 and a uh, Boya over here, which is connected to another S7. So I've got the same phones. So uh, let's see how the sound is going to be. So I will keep changing uh, the sound uh, in between. Uh, you will be seeing a icon over here, uh, which will show you which sound you're hearing right now. So uh, in the end, we will be able to decide which sound is going to be better for you. So let's start. Let's start the test. Now let's uh, start the bike and then uh, hear the sound, how it's going to be. So let's go. But what I've done is I've kept the mic inside, uh, the lavalier mic is inside, it is being covered by my t-shirt. So most of the wind is taken by that. Uh, let's hope you're able to hear me well. Now uh, let's wear a helmet and then see how the sound is going to be. Okay, so this is the kind of sound that you hear when you are riding a bike. The mic is actually behind the t-shirt, uh, there is a windshield on it. So this is the kind of normal scenario that uh, you will face uh, when you are actually riding a bike and you want to use the mic. So hopefully the sound is good. So let's go back to the studio now and then do the test, uh, rest of the test over there. Uh, can't go near any people because of Corona situation. I'm doing the wind test now, uh, wind sound test. So I'm in a spot in my uh, society where there is a lot of wind. So you can see the, uh, the entire wind gets channeled through here and you get a lot of wind. So right now there is a lot of wind, not, uh, I mean, this is a scenario where uh, like if you're doing a vlogging uh, on top of a hill or something, and uh, I mean, which I've done, uh, my main problem was getting the sound. There was a lot of wind. So this is the kind of uh, sound that you'll get in windy situation. Okay, so you've seen the video. Now you know how it actually sounds like outdoors. So indoors, both of them perform the same. You don't really notice any difference. Even now, uh, the sounds are being recorded from uh, both the mics. Uh, now, what I've done is what I've, uh, what's different right now is that I've kept the fan on. So you will get a little bit of the wind sound in the studio. So a lot of people have this question, like the studio gets really hot because of all the lights. So can they put on the fan? So generally, I don't do that. I keep the fan off. I put on the AC and then uh, cool down the um, studio and then I do my recordings so all in all uh, what do I think about this let me look at my notes so things I noticed with Boya uh, the Boya mic uh, is a little bassy uh, it is louder than the JBL one and it gets more of the background sound in uh, now it includes the wind sound also so it the uh, sponge actually the windshield actually works decently but it's not that great when there's a lot of wind so as soon as I accelerated when the bike was fast the sound was not that great now let's talk about JBL now the JBL mic has a balanced sound it's not too bassy uh, now uh, it does get a little bit of the background sound but much less than the Boya one and the wind noise reduction was excellent so with the uh, JBL you could hear me very clear uh, there were no crackling of my voice with the Boya there was a time when there was even crackling my voice uh, was disappearing in between a little bit so that I've noticed with Boya and it's been my experience in the past three years all the bike trips and all I've done uh, and if I've gone to hill stations and all uh, the mic is not that effective in those scenarios the wind is not uh, going to be blocked by this that much now uh, when after the test i actually compared the sponge so the windshield the jbl one is a little more denser than the boya one so the quality is definitely different so for the extra price you do get better quality on the jbl even though they look almost the same only when you test it you will know whether they are the same or not so that's what i felt 
now uh, one thing before i end the video let me tell you about things that you have to take care of in the three years of using this mic what all i felt uh, the windshield keeps falling off the sponge on it will fall off so you have to uh, put some kind of double sided tape or something and keep it in place uh, if not it'll keep i have already lost two so that's something you have to take care of uh, avoid touching it to your body where there's sweat because this will soak in sweat and then it will be unhygienic and you might get a rash uh, second uh, and uh, with that uh, don't wear any um, any chain or any other uh, or any bag strap or something coming from like uh, from uh, top because when that rubs against it uh, it makes a lot of sound so that's why you would have seen all the professional mics are actually suspended so they have this ring and then it's suspended so little bit of vibration also it uh, that suspension takes it away so you do not get that so with this even a slight vibration will be caught to so make sure you uh, don't put anything there and one major thing which happens to me a lot of time now with them the switch uh, it's easily switchable as in when you're putting it in the pocket itself it might switch on or switch off so make sure that when you start the recording you check if you're in the right position if it's for smartphone make sure it's in the smartphone mode if you're using it for a camera make sure it's in the camera mode so that's basically it so that's my opinion i like the jbl better but there's one thing which i like uh, better uh, over here of the boya that is the case so the um, the pouch sorry the pouch uh, this actually protects it from a little bit of splash so if uh, there's water falling on it uh, it will not go in from here so you can just wipe it off with this if water falls on it it'll go in so this is just cloth so this is the only thing where the jbl is not uh, having an upper hand over the boya so that's basically it that's it for this video if you like the video please subscribe with the like button and do comment and i'll see you again with another video bye bye